Hello, and welcome to Queen's Crafts by Bridget. I'm Bridget. Thank you for joining me today. Whether you're new here or you've been around since my very beginning, I truly appreciate you coming by and spending some time with me. If you are looking for me into anywhere on the internet besides YouTube, you can find me on my Facebook group page. I no longer have Instagram as I've had several incidences lately with people cloning my account, which doesn't make any sense because I don't have enough people following me to even bother, but they have. And the constant pornographic pictures in my inbox have just become too much. So I have deleted my Instagram account. If you see anybody on there with my name, my pictures, it is a fake and I am sorry for whatever that jerk <clears throat> has said or tried to scam you into. My apologies. I have nothing to do with it. I have taken my account off of Instagram and I have reported the uh, ones that I could find. But you can find me on my Facebook group page. Just a quick couple little questions to answer and I'll let you write in. I am the only admin, so sometimes it'll take me just a little bit longer to get to you because, well, sometimes I have to sleep <laughs> and sometimes I'm taking care of the king. Uh, you can also reach me directly at my email and if you wish, I can give you my Discord name and you can talk to me on Discord as well. Whatever works best for you will work for me. Now. We have um, cauldron names to give you today, and we will, as soon as we put these names in the pot, we will shake it all up, and we will pick the winner for December. Also, Happy New Year to everybody. I'm sorry I did not start with that. Um, it's been a little bit of a rough time here lately, <clears throat> but I'll get into that before the end of the video. Now, these are in no particular order. I had to cut them up before coming on so that we could fold them and put them in the cauldron as soon as I called their name. Uh, let's see, we have... Denise, Denise, we have Sugar Diamond, and we have Oodles and Caboodles. We have Knit Pearl and Squirrel. We have Eight Smiley Lady. We have Sugar Diamond. We have Kathy Barker, Deborah Richardson, Art Junkie, Deb Douglas, Barb Jarvie, Sh hmm. She. I cannot say your name. I'm sorry, sweetheart. If you win, I'll show you. <laughs> Yolanda Perkins. Treasures Made From Yarn, Mama G Gear, Kelly Rose Smith, Celestial Rogue, Roaming with Rover, Rover Tracy LG, Treasures Made From Yarn, and Sally Stevens. <clears throat> now, while I'm chit-chatting with you about what's going on, I'm going to be folding these up and popping them into the cauldron. So, um... It'd be about five days ago now, four days ago. As you all know, or most of you know, oh, and this was a gift from uh, Melanie at Lathalia's Little Hook. It was part of my gift from, we did a secret Santa in a group that I'm in, and Melanie was unfortunate enough to grow me. <laughs> Thank you, Mel. I absolutely love my crown, and it does look oh so beautiful on my head. <clears throat> but anyways, now, sorry, I got distracted. Um, most of you know that recently the king has had hip replacement surgery. And, of course, um, earlier in the year, he also had a blood clot. I'm not going to go into all his medical details as the king is a very private man and I don't believe that, that would, he would like that very much. But to give an overall, this is what's going on, I had to call EMS and he needed to be rushed to the emergency room. <clears throat> 
he is currently in the hospital with a uh, blood clot in his lung. And he is going to be there for a bit longer as he is also having issues with his gallbladder and gallstones. So um, there's more than likely going to be a procedure to get rid of the gallstones, if not um, to get rid of the gallbladder entirely. Now, I'm not 100% sure of everything they're going to do or when they're going to do it, but he is going to be there for at least another three to four days. <clears throat> and then we will have to continue on to speak with his hip surgeon um, because we uh, missed an appointment due to him being in the hospital. That's about all I can say for now. He is okay. He is in a stable. Um, he is stable. Um, but it's been a rough road. So, um, positive, positive thoughts and goodwill is greatly appreciated. Prayers are just as good and very much appreciated. No matter how, how you believe and how you do, if you can send some goodwill this way, <clears throat> I would greatly appreciate it. I know he would too. Oh, okay, we're almost done here. Um, I've been doing a little spinning while at his bedside. I've also been working on the dress. I'll show you what I've spun up and uh, how far I've gotten on the dress. I have started ball number four. I think maybe two more and I should be at my uh, my desired length. <clears throat> I'm guesstimating. Um, however, I have done, you know, a couple increases. So, um, you know, it takes a little longer now to get all the way around. Than it did in the past or you know did previously all right we have an absolutely stuffed cauldron this time <coughs> fabulous thank you to each and every one of you whether you made it in here or not you are appreciated and uh i i think though i got frustrated with it a little bit and the views were nowhere near what my normal video views are I think overall the um, the advent was a success. I enjoyed uh, participating with Ray, and I very much enjoyed uh, spinning up the beautiful fibers that she sent for me. I truly love the blanket that uh, <clears throat> I made with my minis, and I hope to do another project with minis again shortly. Okay, we're gonna shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them up, shake them down, shake them all around, shake it, shake it, shake. Okay, lid off, and up. This one. Oh, oh, Miss Sharon. And you know I can't say your name, so we're just going to leave it at Miss Sharon. <laughs> and you please email me as to your earliest convenience, and I will get you a little box of loveliness on the way. I'm going to leave those in there just in case, although I know Miss Sharon will contact me because she comments on almost every single one of my videos. And I appreciate that and everybody else okay um let's see let's go with well I showed you guys when I showed you um when I did the introducing my my ladies or my tools um my drop spindle my uh Turkish drop spindle that I have received from Jude over at Llamas in Pajamas. I named Jade and she finished up this little mini. This was a single when I showed you the spindle. There we go. Okay. 
And then I had a bit of fluff left from what Ray sent me because it accidentally fell on the floor and didn't get spun into its original ball. So while at the emergency room, I spun this up. I did the single and then uh, two ply. And that will be dyed with the rest of it that needs to be dyed here shortly. And then I did this one today while I was up visiting with the king because he slept most of the time, which is okay. You do your best healing when you are sleeping, so I encourage him to rest when he can, whether I am there or not. <clears throat> and last night, to ring in the new year and rid myself a little of a little stress, do a little bit of grounding without going outside and freezing everything off, I... Uh, Spent some time with Athena, and I rang in the new year, spinning up some beautiful yarn. This is the really dark uh, stuff that I, I dyed earlier on in the month that we did on the wood stove together. Well, no, this one we didn't do on the wood stove, but it was done during that time. And then this was the mini because, well, I spun it at different times, guys, and my tension was a little bit different. And I think I had a little bit more in one side than the other. So, or my thickness, not my tension. Sorry, guys, I'm a little, I ain't sleeping much. But they will go together. I think that's, this is a two-ply fractal and this is just, chain ply with what was left over off of the one bobbin. I think that turned out so lovely. And you know, the camera really, really does a wonderful job with this color. This is about spot on for uh, the color that it actually is. It's absolutely beautiful if I don't say so myself. And it was a wonderful way to uh, de-stress. And uh, last night I actually did get a couple hours of sleep. So it did what it needed to do. <clears throat> and then. The skirt's really getting long. There, you can see it a little better. How it flows out. Isn't that beautiful? Now, I had to think of a way to increase for the virus stitch without putting a corner in. I was able to do that. I'm quite proud of myself. Not to pat myself on the back, but, you know. When you figure something out, it feels really good. And I know that uh, the king is going to get better. And I'm going to get to meet him at the altar wearing this. And I know that it's going to make him smile. <clears throat> okay well guys uh that's about all i can muster for today i'm about to bust into tears again for absolutely uh no apparent reason so i'm gonna get out of here before that happens uh i will be back for a stash down video shortly um uh, probably in the next couple of days. It's not real impressive, but I want to give you some updates and hopefully you'll all or many of you will join me for Stash Down 2024. I really hope that you do. Um, Stash Down 2023 wasn't a huge success, but it was a success and I am very, very pleased with what I was able to do, even though um, I didn't do it quite as much as what I had hoped. I can see the difference out in the uh, the other craft room and it is making me very, very happy. So I think we're going to do a little, you know, this is where we're starting the year at video and then we can end the year with look how much we did um, next year. 
the end of this year, I mean. Um, so I think that would be really neat. And I also want to kind of track my ball bands a little bit more next this year and uh, kind of write everything down kind of so I can have a, at the end of the year, this is how many projects I did overall and, you know, kind of have a sum total this year. I do not because I am not very organized like that. I, I have the want to be. I just don't have the execution but we are working on it I am slowly getting better at that kind of stuff hanging out with some of my more organized girlfriends all right for real this time I'm gonna hop on out of here I hope that each and every one of you has a very happy and healthy new year and that 2024 brings you all the joy that is possible until next time, I hope that you are crafting your happiness. Bye for now. I take that back. We are seven away, seven away from 1,500. If you have not commented on the 1,500 subscriber giveaway, it's linked in the comments. First link at the top. Make sure you go over there, leave any kind of comment. There's no specific keyword, any kind of comment, because when that's drawn, I'm going to need you to, con you know, to uh, be part of that. And I'm going to draw it. It's basically as soon as we hit 1500 and I know it's there. So make sure you comment on that video. Now for real. Bye.